Race four of the BMW IBS F Women's Skeleton World Cup for the first time in seven years at La Plagne in France. Tina Herman, the winner a week earlier in Winterberg in Germany, lying in fifth position after the first heat. 48 hundreds out of the lead, but still in with a shot at the medals. There are only 15 hundreds ahead of her. First job, though, to beat teammate Sophia Griebel, which she did comfortably, and then wait and see what everybody else brought to the party. Wearing the yellow jersey of our World Cup points leader, Jacqueline Lurling, winner of the season opener in Lake Placid, where she also took a silver medal just off the podium on her home track in Winterberg, but she took the lead of the race. There were still three sleds to go, however. In third place, and with a shot at the medals, Marina Gilardoni, one of just two women in the field who had raced in the last World Cup here back in 2012. First job, though, to beat Jacqueline Lurling, and at the line, she was a scant five hundreds of a second behind. Still a medal chance, but an outside one. Two sleds to go. Janine Flock, 11th place here in the 2012 race. And could she now take the lead? She'd have to have a superhuman effort to win, but she needed to stay in front of Jacqueline Lurling and another good, strong second heat from Flock put her 2100s clear and at least a silver medalist. In the first heat, Elena Nikitina had broken the start record and the decade old track record. And in heat two, she did it again. A new start record, six seconds exactly, and a brand new track record beating her previous best to run away and win by 65 hundredths of a second. A shattering margin of victory on a track that she's barely seen before. Janine Flock took the silver, Jacqueline Lurling the bronze, but the runaway winner, Elena Nikitina. Janine Flock still leads the World Cup standings as we head to race five in Innsbruck.